Live from News 4 New York, this is a special report. Hello everyone, David Ushery once again updating you on what can only be described as a very dangerous and volatile situation right now in the southern part of Jersey City. We've been watching a live feed and witnessed a war zone really, a volley of gunfire that was extraordinary. I'm going to take you out to News 4's Adam Cooperstein and Eddie Alonzo who have been there. Adam, I know you're there. You're in a safe position. If you have to just run, do it because we just know what you just heard and witnessed. The war zone is right, David. We've heard return fire now, gunshots for about 10 minutes straight, dozens of shots. We've seen a, a number of officers, armed officers running by us because let me show you how close we are to the situation. That police tape is less than two blocks away from the bodega where law enforcement sources tell us one officer was shot in the head as in now critical condition. This is inside a bodega where a man and a woman, according to our sources, are holed up inside in some sort of standoff situation. And, and you can see ambulance, SWAT teams, federal, state officials here, and the response is growing by the minute. We have not heard gunshots now in the last minute or two, but let me play for you what this sounded like when you mentioned a war zone. Take a look and a listen. Okay, let me explain to you where this is happening because if you're in the area, officials are telling everyone stay inside and stay safe. And of course, again, we are going to be sure that we're safe uh, as this ongoing shootout with police. You just heard another number of gunshots. We're going to back up again. You hear the, oh, the fire is getting louder and faster right now. Uh, we are behind the police tape still. This is happening at MLK at Bidwell inside a bodega. Chopper just arrived over scene as well. As you can see, dozens of onlookers out here from the neighborhood who are shooting cell phone video as this is happening. And now the gunfire increased again. You can smell the gun smoke from here. Uh, again, here's what we know right now. All of this preliminary, as you can see, ongoing situation, uh, a possible ambush situation where law enforcement sources tell us at least one police officer was shot in the head. That officer, as far as we know, in critical condition inside a bodega where a man and a woman at last check were holed up inside. And the way that the gunfire sounds from out here, we see all the SWAT teams, the officers on the outside of the bodega. We can't see what's happening inside, but it certainly sounds like return fire from the inside of that bodega. Of course, we're going to continue to, to check to confirm that. But here's the scene behind us. You can see there's people all over the streets right now. Um, also worth noting, you're going to see if we come over here, uh, Eddie Alonzo making sure that we're safe as well. Uh, the, the Hasidic Jewish police, the response teams are out here as well. And uh, we did speak to a witness and to some of the other uh, Hasidic Jews from the neighborhood. I believe this is a kosher supermarket where this is happening. We'll have to work to confirm that. But that would explain why the Hatzola, the, the Jewish paramedics, are out here right now. Uh, as this ongoing standoff with police continues. Here's what a witness told us just a little bit ago. Okay, you know what, we'll get to that in a second because this is ongoing and, and you can see that uh, the police are, police are still trying to figure this out. If you can see that right now, more responding officers surrounding that bodega right there in the corner of MLK Drive and Bidwell. And uh, we're going to stay with this for a second because it looks like their gunfire stopped for the last 60 seconds or so, 90 seconds or so. It's hard for me to tell, but hopefully with that camera zoom, you can get a pretty good look at what's going on. But every corner of this area in Jersey City lined with officers, state, federal, local, everybody is here right now trying to get this thing resolved as safely as possible. But again, we do know from law enforcement sources, one Jersey City, uh, here in Jersey City, one police officer was shot in the head inside that bodega where a man and a woman, at least a man and a woman, are holed up inside. Thank you for watching this video from NBC4 New York. You can subscribe by tapping the button below me. And on the left, you can see our latest updates, investigations, and digital exclusives. We'll see you next time.